Hello, my sweet babies. How's everyone doing today? I guess I'm doing all right. Now, we're going to be doing this mold today. Now, if y'all remember, on my teapot or coffee pot uh, clock video, I used this glow in the dark. I had some left over, so I just put it in the eyes of this glasses holder. That's what this is. It holds your glasses. Now, I may look over there and that thing might scare me to death with them eyeballs glowing, but hey, we'll see. Now, what I want to do is I want to go around the edge and here with rhinestones, okay? Now, one of my sweet babies sent me this kit, and it's been a while back. I can't remember who sent it, but whoever sent it, thank you very much, baby doll. I'm finally going to use it about that. Now then, in the kit, you get rhinestones. You get um, double-ended. This picks up your gems and puts them on there for you. I'm not going to need none of that. Now, here's some colors. I don't want that. And then we just got diamonds in there. And right here, we got different colors. I'm going to go with this one. Look at that. Look at these. Look at these. Let me see if I can get it open. Look at those. Oh, those are beautiful, aren't they? So I'm going to be using these. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to take some UV resin, and I'm going to go around this rim, and then I'm going to lay my um, rhinestones in there, and that's going to be that. Now look at here in this kit. It comes with templates that you can put your... Uh, rhinestones in to keep them from flaying around it comes with all kinds of stuff honey all kinds of stuff comes with it's called a hot fix so this right here you put these little things in this plug it in it gets hot and you fix your rhinestones to it comes with all kind of little stuff now if i can find the kit i will uh put it down below because this was a blessing that was sent to me look at there you get those little wax things you get a measure and a ruler you get the little bag to put it all in and i think that's what i'm gonna do because my little the back of my box is broke it's broke so i can shut it but this right here is still broke oh, oh my goodness yeah okay so i'm gonna put these back in here all right one day we're gonna use that hot fix to do our butter, we'll do a butterfly on something. Mm hmm. Sure will. Hope nobody don't steal my idea. <sighs> you know, you have ghost watchers, people that watch you and never comment, and then they go do what you show before you get to do it, which is fine because mine's going to look different than theirs. You know, I, they're not going to look the same, so it's totally fine. Okay, now. I'm going to take my UV resin, and I'm going to go around this little rim, around its eyes. See this little rim? Go around its eyes with my rhinestones. Now, y'all know I get carried away, right? So, I may have to just put some here. Okay, you know, just to make it look right. All right, so let me do that, and I'll be right back. All right, I got my little rhinestones ready. Now I'm sure I'm, I may need more than that. I'm not sure, but we'll see. Got those ready. Ain't that beautiful and sparkly? And then I'm out of UV resin, so I'm going to have to use UV varnish sealer. It's UV, so hey, maybe it'll work. Okay, and then I want my nose to be black. So I'm going to use black mica powder by Less Resin. Love this stuff. And then I'm going to just coat the whole thing in the silver mica powder. That's going to be pretty and sparkly, is what I think. Might change my mind. Y'all know me. Okay. But that's what my thoughts are for right now. Okay. Now, got my little tweezers. So, let's just get started. Now, what I'm going to do is a little bit at a time. Okay. Look at that. mm 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 mm, -mm. I wipe it off. All right, here we go. I'm gonna put just a little dibble. 
I'm going to show y'all what I'm going to do, and then I'm going to lay it down, okay? Always put your lid on your UV, because if you don't, honey baby, look at that. All right, got it. Now I'm just going to pick me up some rhinestones and put them in, okay? And hope they stay upside down, because I want them upside down. Because when you demold it, the pretty side going to be on the other side, okay? You just want them to lay in it. You don't have it. Don't have to be covered. They don't have to be covered with UV. You just want them down in the UV. So when you cure it, they'll stay in it. You see what I mean? I'll get that out for cure it. So a biggie. All right. Now this is going to take me a minute. So once I get it done and get it cured. I'll be back. All right, darlings. All right, darlings. Got the rhinestones going around the eyes. Now, I'm going to have to put some here. Because that is just blah. It's blah. So, I'm going to have to just lay some here. Won't take but a second. Now, this right here it took maybe 20 minutes. It didn't really take that long. But if you got a bad back, I wouldn't advise it. Okay. Now, this right here was a miracle tool that come out of that kit. Look at that. It's got a little skinny end, and it's got a fat end. I picked up the rhinestone with the fat end, put it in the UV in there, flipped it over, and took the little end and moved it. Oh, this thing is something else. All right, darlings. Let me get this done, and I'll be back, and we'll pour I'm also going to go around the rim of his eye with this Diamond Dust Glitter UV Resin White. Okay? It's white. All right? All right. I got his eyes done. Now, remember, you're looking at the back. Okay? This is the back. All right. Now then, I'm going to mix up my resin. Now, y'all, that's his lips. That is his lips. Let me turn it over very carefully. See? That's his mouth. And that line going across there is his lip. The eyes is going to scare me. I already know. But anyway, I'm going to try to find... I don't have a black um, paint pen in here. And I don't know if a Sharpie will come off on the resin. But if it don't, I'll just take the sharpie when I demold it because it's going to be an indention and or I can take black uh, UV glitter and put it down in there and cure it same thing right but we'll figure that out now I'm going to get my resin mixed up I am going to be using super clear resin one to one trying to get rid of that stuff so let me get it mixed up and I'll be right back Alrighty, got my resin mixed up. Now, we're going to mix up a little bit of black for his nose. Because I want his nose black. Nose in his outline of his mouth. So, I'm just going to pour me just a little bit in, in here. I don't think it's going to take that much. And I mixed up 8 ounces. I uh, hope that's enough. <laughs> Oh my goodness, baby, too much. I don't know. That still don't look like enough for that nose. All right. Okay. Now then, let's get our mica. And I'm using the black mica by Less Resin. I think I told y'all. Oh, I'm getting low. I'm getting low on everything. Am I a UV resin? I'm out of uh, polyurethane. Oh, baby. Baby darlings. I don't know. It's some more stuff. I'm out of. That's okay. We're going to make it. We're going to make it what, what I got. Ain't we, babies? All right. Let's get this good and mixed up without fluffing it everywhere. Because I usually do. I'm just going to go real slow. There we go. Get it all good and mixed in. I 
get that bottom look at that black baby that's pretty okay now I know Squidward is a seafoam green and if this is Squidward and it sure looks like Squidward I'm just gonna have me a bling bling Squidward okay you can do whatever you want in art right make it whatever you want okay let me give it a little speedy of alcohol that way to pop the surface bubbles and here we go let's just pour this black in now I don't want it to go crazy I'm just gonna let it come right up to that nose part that nose part okay give it another little spritz because I see some bubbles Maybe a little more. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to go with it. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and mix up. I'm going to use this uh, silver mica in there. In, in the rest of the resin. And I'm just going to pour it in. And see what we come up with. We might come up with something pretty. I'll put about four ends of that four ends of that stick of the silver okay now this stuff lays around so be really careful but it is gorgeous all right here we go oh wait look at that sparkle look at the bubbles oh my goodness look at that mm hmm so what I'm thinking we're gonna do oh that's gorgeous I can't quit looking at it I'm sorry all right let me get to getting what we're gonna do now here I'm just gonna pour around these eyes and if it goes off in that nose I'm going to pour with the black. Okay? <laughs> I don't know if it's going to work, but we finna see. I'm going to start right here around these eyes. And I know it's going to go down into that crack. I'm going to come over here and hurry up and get this side. All right, we got that. Now here it comes. Now get ready. Get ready. I hope y'all can see what I'm doing. Here it comes. Black. And hopefully that'll keep it from. Black. <laughs> I don't know what we're going to have. But you know what? It is what it is. I'm pouring. I'm pouring. Y'all see it, don't you? <laughs> I don't know <laughs> oh my goodness now I'm going to take this here stick and I'm going to try to pull this black back I know it's not going to work you know what we could do just swirl it around now he's probably going to have one heck of a black face and a white face and I'm just going to swirl this because it's on the top anyway so, I mean the back. It's not on the top. So, I'm just going to swirl it. Make it pretty. Make it pretty on both sides, huh? All right. Now, we're going to see what we get, loves. I'm going to put it on the... I don't see any black around these edges. But I do see black here on the front. Y'all see that? So, boop scooped. Now, I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to uh, use this UV. I, not UV, my goodness. The rest of this resin in another mold. And um, y'all have an extra. Hang a dang when you come back. An extra mold to uh, demold. How about that? All right, babies. I'll see y'all when it's cured. Good morning. All right, darlings. It's ready to demold. Now, let me tell you what happened. Weird. Y'all can see that little 
Humpy. The nose cured and rose up. Came up. I had to keep pushing it down to keep it down in there. Is that not the weirdest thing? I've never had that happen before, ever. So, let's demold it and see what we got. Oh, honey. Ain't no telling what this thing going to look like on the other side. But my diamonds, my rhinestones did not um, come up. The nose. <laughs> I know, it's weird. It's weird. Okay, let's see what we got. Clean mold. That's a good sign. All right, baby dolls. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. It didn't turn out too bad. There's a little black right here. But it's cute. And a little black here. But look at the rhinestones, guys. <laughs> I'm hoping I can get it in the light for y'all. Let me get up here. Look at that. Oh, my goodness gracious. Now, the white did come over somehow. How it done that, I don't know. Because I used UV. Oh, I didn't cover them. I did not cover them before I poured my white. That's what happened. But anyway, I think it's cute. All right. Let's outline his little mouth. I'm going to be using the Diamond Dust Glitter UV Resin in black. Get it right. Okay. So, I'm going to outline his mouth and cure it. Just going to make a line. There's a little indention here. Then he has a dimple. Okay. And then you come over here and do the same thing on this side. And a little dimple. Okay. Now I'm going to cure it. And I'll be right back. Alright. There's his little mouth. My <laughs> oh, goodness how sweet that is. Now let me show y'all. I did find the uh, Hot Fix Rhinestone Super Kit on Amazon. Now I want to show y'all. Look at this. It's Prime Day. So it's 33% off. It's only $22.09. It was $32.99. I'll have the link in my description. Y'all go get you one. Look at that. Honey, you can't beat that with a stick. Okay. So there's that. Okay. Let's see how it looks with my glasses on it. Oh my goodness. Y'all. Y'all. <laughs> <laughs> this little mole makes me super happy. <laughs> it is so stinking cute, is it not? I love it. I really do love it. I love it. <laughs> now, I got some big old glasses, but that is adorable. <laughs> All right, darlings. All right, let's make his eyes glow. See what I'm going to see in the night. It's probably going to scare me. Okay, that, that should be enough. Cut the light off. Oh, my goodness gracious. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Look at those rhinestones blinging, though. Oh, my goodness gracious. That is so freaking cute to me. That is just so stinking cute. All right, darlings. If y'all enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I want to thank all my members. I want to thank all of my um, subscribers for giving me sub love. I do appreciate it, baby dolls. I thank you for all your comments using my affiliate links. Everything I used will be in my description, okay? And uh, continue prayers for Miss Christine, Miss Carol Answer Christ, Miss Carol Rogers, Miss Lisa Provost. Miss Trish Green, Miss Brenda Levi's friend, and Miss Amy at Amy's Resin Corner. Okay, darlings. Now let's get a prayer card. Here we go. He lifted me out of the slimy pit, out of the mud and myrrh. 
He set my feet on a rock and gave me a firm place to stand. Amen. Psalm chapter 40, verse 2. Amen, darlings. All right, sweet angels. <laughs> I'm going to let y'all go, and I appreciate y'all watching. I do appreciate it so, so very much. And I love you all, darlings. All right, babies. Peace, love, prayers, and happiness. Bye.